congratulations, you picked Pierce. And so, for a special surprise for picking me, you are going to see a review of Bruticus and the Combaticons. Because I'm awesome. And I know this is not G1 or G2, it's R.I.D. All these guys are R.I.D. And I will be calling them by their G1 names, not their R.I.D. names. Just to let you know. Okay, so, this one is complete, by the way, minus the little individual people guns. Um, Alright, so, first, we'll start out with Swindle. He is a pretty simple transformer. All you have to do is flip up the windshield. Oh, and really quick, a fact about most RIDs is they're two different colors, pretty much. They're just... Most of them, yeah. Okay. So, you're going to flip back the windshield. There's his head. Pull down his feet. Flip him over. Or around. And, pull out his arms. Boom. There's Swindle. Okay. So, next, we'll do Brawl. Okay, so what you're going to do is first you're going to want to pull up this little tank part right there, just to make it a little easier. Then you're only going to pull up just a little bit, it'll only move like half a centimeter. And then flip out the legs, as so, like that. Then you will fold down the chest, like so, fold down his arms. Arms. Push the back tank in the thing as far as you can. Not without forcing it though. You don't want to break it. Okay, next we'll do blast off. So blast off is again pretty simple. Fold this either way, the back tail fin thing, fold these up, like so. Pull this apart so that you have both of them. Pull that apart, pull that apart. Okay, then you're gonna pull these down, turn it around front the nose cone on both parts, flip them around, and pull them down, and there's blast off. Okay, now for Vortex. He gets a little frustrating sometimes because his legs are kind of hard. Okay, so first I'm going to take off the blade just to make it a little easier. You take off the blade, there's a little red thingy right there. It goes right into that little Make sure you don't take off the backpack thing. Yeah, the back. The back doesn't come off. Back doesn't come off. It's not very good. No, again, you don't want to break anything. Okay, so you're gonna simply pull these up, pull the tail ends apart, pull the tail or er, back thingy down like this. Oh, you can do that. Yeah. No fact. Pull them down all the way. Yes, and flip them, just like blast off. Okay, now for the. Oh, and then flip his back around. Now, for the ever so frustrating legs. Now, I, they might actually come out right, so. Okay, so you're going to pull them. Twist them around, but don't, like, lock them in all the way. You're just going to want to have them at diagonal, kind of. Okay, then you're going to push them in. No, wait, no. Never mind, they stay out for his robot. Mode. And then they'll slip down, and boom! There he is. Alright, oh, and then you reattach the blade on the back if you want to. Makes it look really cool. Alright. Now uh what's his name? Onslaught, Onslaught thank you. Uh, okay, so Onslaught. They also do, by the way, sell a Bruticus version of Universe, the original Universe, not 2.0. And there's kind of like a tan black camo sort of thing. Or Transformers Collectors Club. Same toy, but different colors. Yeah, and they also have like some. No, that's the Energon version. Oh, whatever. And they have the Energon version of this guy, except two of them are. Three of them are from Combaticons. Two of them are the Aerial Bots. And they form Nexus Maximus. Oh, I didn't know. I thought it was all one set, like one set of people. No, because then, then two of them would be the same. Because the Energon, they always had two of them the same. Okay, so. Um, Onslaught. An interesting fact, by the way, is this is one of the only people where if you take his gun, he can actually hold it in his vehicle mode. And I just figured this out like two seconds ago. Okay. Or you can attach it by that little hole. 
and this little peg right here, you can put it on there, like that, any kind of way you want. Okay, so, transformation. First, you're going to take this tank part off, and by the way, we're going to transform him into his landing bay mode first. Pull his legs apart, or back of the truck, so they're straight, then form them at an angle, like this. Pull the front of the truck apart and around so that it looks like this. Turn the head around. I'm just going to turn the whole body instead of the head. Okay. And then if you have the G1 Trypticon, not the universe or classics version, it's just the purple Cybertron, Cybertron Scourge, then if you have him in a city mode, he'll hook on to the back of his head right there. Okay, and if you don't have Trypticon, then no fear. Turn his head back around. And you can put the tank that we took off earlier, part of it, and hook that part on right there onto the back of his head also. So it should just slide right in. And it'll look like this. Now we're still not done yet. And we have the ramp. The ramp there should just be like a little hook right there. See that little kind of straight thingy? And there should be a little slot light right there. Sorry, I had to take the tank part off. Put it back on. There we go. Alright. So, and then you're simply just going to put them together. And boom, there's this landing bay mode. Alright. Now, to get him in his robot mode, you're going to take this off. Take the tank off. Alright, and then you've almost got him in robot mode just by doing this. So his head's facing this way, like that. Like his head's facing that way, see, there's his little eyes facing that way. Okay, then you're gonna pull the legs apart and down. And you're gonna flip them up, the back of them up. And then these are the arms right here. And you're just gonna flip them out or flip the hands out, pull them out, and then just one last step, you have the chest piece, we'll hook on right into that little slot right there, with this little thingy right there, that thing that sticks out, okay, hooks right on in there, and if you want to, he can have the Bruticus, he can hold the Bruticus gun in his hand, and again, I always do the left hand because I'm left-handed. Interesting fact again. I'm right-handed again. Interesting. Okay, so, you can hold the gun. Alright, now, for combining them into Bruticus. So first, we'll start with Swindle again. He is going to be a foot. So, we're going to flip his arms back to normal position, slide them in, and push his feet down. Boom, there he is, again. Another interesting Swimple. fact is they all have heads. Wow, I didn't know that. I know! Okay, Brawl, another pretty simple one, is you're going to flip this back out, or kind of pull it, twist it, whatever. Flip the arms back to their original position. Flip the legs back up. Boom, there he is. Okay, Vortex. Vortex is... By the way, Brawl was a leg, so this is his leg. Oh, you're going to push the tank part back in. Uh, Vortex is going to be a leg, or arm. Can't have three legs. So, you're simply just going to kind of put them at a diagonal angle, his legs, and push them in like so until they lock in, or they're able to lock in. Then you're simply just going to put the tail, pot, tail blade majigger back into its original position. Flip that up. Oops. Okay. And push that back. And then you'll flip this little thing right there out. Like so. Let's see, now it's gone. Oh, there it is. Okay. And then you'll push these. And now for Blast Off. Blast Off, you're pretty much just going to turn these around 
his little hands, put him back up, he'll be at arm, into the original position, slide him down, and then you're going to flip that out right there. Oh, and just so you people know on YouTube, if there is a Transformer you want us to review, uh, you can request it on the comments, and we could possibly be able to review it if we had it. Yes, so. we don't have every Transformer, but we have some of them, most of them. Yeah. Well, not most of them, but, you know, we got a lot. Um, so just leave them in the comments bar, and, okay, so on with this thing. <laughs> okay, so that's going to flip out, and you're going to push that, this right here. <laughs> push it down. Okay, so those are all of his limbs. Now, for Onslaught, you're going to first take the gun out. Okay, first going to take the gun out. Oops. Um, and then, sorry, kick some people over there. Alright, take the gun out. Take the chest plate out. That one. And, oh, by the way, if you don't want to lose all the parts, besides little individual guns, which I never had. Um, then you can take this little chest plate, put it on swindle right there, and it fits, just like that. And the helicopter guy, you can put his blade on his backpack thing, where yes. it normally goes. Oh, and you also want to flip the background also. Grab oh, that. yeah. Okay, uh, let's see. Then you're going to flip the put, push the hands in. And then flip the arms back. And let's see, he goes this way, right? Yep, he does. And then you're going to take the legs and put them back into the way he had the landing bay mode. Put them that way. And then you're going to attach limbs on. Like that. Okay, sorry, I kind of have to hurry up now. We're about to go get pizza. Woo! Boom, put Swindle on. Boom. Put Vortex on. And by the way, they all have this little peg thing that goes into the little squares. And unless you're stupid, no offense if you are, um, should be pretty easy to put in there. Figure out how it goes in there. Uh, okay. So, and the hands. Right hand will say an R on it, so you'll put that in the right hand socket. And the left butt cheek. Thank you. <laughs> and the left one will say left, so you'll put that in the left. And you'll put them in the ones that are facing forward. So you won't put them. You'll put them in the front one, not the back one, like that. Ooh. Um. Let's see the feet. The feet should have a little L or R. Right there in that corner. Left. So there's his left foot. And where's the other foot? There it is. Right. Or er, which one? Where's that? Right for right foot. R. So it's just kind of a simple little peg hole system there. Uh, and the chest plate. Took chest plate right there. Put it where in the onslaught chest where his other chest plate was. Okay, now these next two parts, most other combiners don't have. The back cannon, like that. These two little pegs will go right into those two little holes. And then put the helmet on, like that. Put the ramp on, snaps on there. And boom, there's Rukas. Bye! Bye!